y'all welcome back to my channel my name is Holly today we have made it back to one of your favorite homes to see Kayla Fridays her yard is always so cute so I have to show y'all how she has it decorated before we go inside There's Buster. <laughs> Come on. Somebody. Let's show them what we're doing. Let's show them what we see. Hey, everybody. My name is Kayla Friday. If you don't already know me, I've been on Holly's channel a few times. But this is the infamous Buster Brown. He is my one-and-a-half-year-old pit bull puppy. And we live here with my husband, Corey. And our hobby is decorating, so I thought I would bring Holly over and show her what we did for the summertime. I said, get that off me. <laughs> <laughs> get it here. So this is our little makeshift entryway. I don't have a traditional foyer or a little breezeway hallway, so I just set up a little vignette right here. I don't know if I'm saying that correctly, but that's how it looks like it's supposed to be said. <laughs> looks like it to me. <laughs> a vignette. A vignette. So anyway. So I just have my door and my shutter and I just draped this older American flag um, that I got at Farmhouse and Family. And then I have an old um, vintage churn, ice cream churn. And I didn't I, even realize that's what that was. Yeah, it's just old ice cream churn. And then these are flowers that my mom dried for me and also my coworker Nene grows beautiful hydrangeas and I dried some of hers too. Just added a little tea towel. And these, this is your cheap decor. So my husband's parents have some land down in Marbury, Alabama, where they have cows. And I found a bunch of old um, tin, cans. tin cans. So I just used those all throughout the house. It's cute. <laughs> those look old. real. Where'd you find those? Oh, those came from Walmart. Those look good. Yes, those came from Walmart. And then there is, um, Holly named hers, so I got to be a copier. And I named mine Esther Ruth. <laughs> Esther Ruth. Now after, tell us why. That's after somebody else. Esther it? was my grandmother on my mother's side, and Ruth is my grandmother on my father's side. And me and Corey said if we ever had a daughter, we would name her Esther Ruth and call her Little Ruthie Friday. <laughs> so here's so, your daughter. Here's my daughter for now. And then these I just love. Jennifer from work, um, she uh, knits me all these. I love using those. Those are nice. What about this flag? Where'd you get that? Because that's pretty. Farmhouse and family. I love that. Mm -hmm. And I like this. Did you paint this or was it already painted? It was that already color? like that and it's black on the other side. So you can use it for oh, Halloween. I like that. That's that came painting. from... Um, Fife, Alabama, vintage picking. So not a lot has changed here. Well, my favorite pieces in the room are my um, vintage um, shutters that I found at um, Dragonflies Antiques, and those stay up all year round. Um, just have my little chair there. Added a Dollar Tree flag to make it more festive. Sweet. Um, and then my um, little rack over here my towel not towels what are those blankets, blankets. Throw blankets. <laughs> the things you cover up with this summer i like to be patriotic i leave up all my patriotic stuff and my red stuff up through labor day so um, when i think about summer you think about all the fun things you get to do and spend time with your family and the only reason you can do that is by the grace of god and brave men and women that fight for our country mm -hmm. so we like to leave up our patriotic stuff um just have this old coca-cola um, and I found this at the thrift store for $6. Oh my gosh, that's gorgeous. Yeah, so, and I gotta put oil in it still. And then this came from Brass Bear. And I love the little flower frogs. I've been using those to put stuff that's in. That's really pretty. What are these? Just old little things that my aunt found when she went on the longest yard sale. Just like little spindle things. Gotcha. They were 50 cents a piece or a dollar a piece. Yeah. And she got me some and I just thought they'd be cute in a tray, so. I love this book too. And this is so cute. I was showing Holly before we started filming. It has all the holidays in it. So for each holiday, you can flip and change it. Show them the front of it. Because they're going to want to know 
It's really cute. That came from the thrift store for a dollar. I love this. I didn't know. I was like, Ooh, so cute. Jacket. And um, not a whole lot's changed over here. I did move this. I did have an old window there. And I moved my tobacco basket in here. And I've just got the hydrangea wreath and some little flags. These are the same flags that I have. She just said that she tea stained them. Yes, so I I'm going to copy her because they look so good. They look vintage. To make them look older and just um, have just changed around my throw pillows a little bit. I love this. And I tea stained that too. I just found an old letter or an old um, diary page on um, Google and I retyped it out printed it and tea stained it and then baked it in the oven for five minutes to dry it and now it looks old in my it old does. I love this. Still have up my cathedrals that I got from um, Farmhouse and Family. Those will be there forever because it took you know half an hour to hang on them. I'm <laughs> never taking them down. <laughs> the whole wall may come down. And then Holly's got that pillow, too. I got that last year at Kirkland. Yeah, I love that pillow. And then the back of it, which I don't know why you would show the back of it, it's because really the front cute. is so cute. It's really cute. And then just some patriotic -y pillows. And then over here, this is my favorite part of the whole living room. It's my vintage Buster Brown postcard. Because, oh, you know, I have my Buster Brown. And I'll turn it around where y'all can see the back of it. It's from 1910. That is so awesome. She said she got that off of Etsy. Because I got to have stuff for my Busted Brown. And then my 1776. Just got some fun patriotic stuff going on around over here. I love all this. I love your red lantern too. That's so cute. Thank you. That came from Rusty Relics. Oh, and then the phone. And I like the little hat hanging on it. That's cute. Shop local. <laughs> and our little recliner and I have found a whole bunch of these at the thrift store this came from the thrift store and that big chunky one on the bottom came from the thrift store so when you go thrifting make sure you look in the blankets because don't these were, tell everything yeah <laughs> don't these are mine they're nasty y'all yeah. don't want yeah. them <laughs> you, they yeah. can't be washed That's right. <laughs> and then this came from the thrift store and just some faux wildflowers those look so real I love those where'd you find those one more Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby. Those and look yes. so good. And then my old um, hymnals and my vintage clock. Love that. And you're going to love this. I got to take this. But look, Grandfather's Farm. Oh, that's sweet. Ain't that cute? That is. You find that at the thrift store? I found that at uh, Brass Bear. Buster Brown. Get out of my eyeball. So I'm getting some kisses. He is. <laughs> So this is my little kitchen where I fire up some awesome home-cooked meals. Um, my favorite thing that I make from scratch is um, Hamburger Helper. Um, we really enjoy Apple Jacks, um, Frosted Flakes, <laughs> um, Spam Sandwiches. Um, my delicacy that I really like is Grilled Spam with Sweet Baby Ray's Barbecue Sauce. Well, Jerry and I going to eat. <laughs> We're going to come eat with you tonight because that all sounds so delicious. I, I really do make some good food. I make good meatloaf. I make really good um, soups. And I make a really good tater tot casserole. Mm. That's my coworkers at work. And don't use that cauliflower crap. Use real tater tots. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's not keto, but it's delicious. Okay, so this is my kitchen. This is an old vintage toolbox I also found at Brass Bear. And I found these hydrangeas at Walmart. Walmart and has stuff to their game. They have. And I just stuffed them all in there. This came from the Brass Bear. I thought it would be really cute for the uh, summertime. It's just it's a little pretty. Um, crochet towel. It's love your plates. Cute. And I love this. Thank you. These? these came from Rustic Relics. And these came from the Target Dollar Spot. A four pack for like $3. Oh my goodness. I love the colors. And this I came like from the Target Dollar Spot. It's pretty. I like this. Where did this plate come from? Oh, the strappity one? Yeah. Um, Michael's. That's really last pretty. Year. I got them at the end of the summer sale, and they were a dollar piece. Well, it looks like you could just have a little picnic, we're gonna have a picnic over at the Fridays. On. Come on. Let me fire up the grill and throw some spam on there. <laughs> um, and so, 
I'm starting to tell. I used sure. I used to only have Ray done, and then I thought it looked a little bit too plain. So, um, and I I just made my little garland. They're similar similar to the ones Holly has, but I just get the fat squares from Walmart. They're a dollar oh, a piece cool. and tie them on there, and they have them for every holiday. But I went in and mixed in some different textures and colors. <laughs> I did the brass or copper and um, some wood. It looks really good. I love the copper in there. Oh, and Holly's gonna love these. I just saw those. Where did you find those? Those are Ray Dunn. Cute. Link, what's the other one? Farm. Farm. You gotta have oh, those, Holly. I love that. Aunt Penny got those for me. Those are cute. I love this little thing, too. That came off of uh, Amazon. That's really cute. And then I found these really cute. Um, I just thought these were really pretty little pottery. Mm -hmm. And I got those on Etsy too. Gosh, I just have those stacked. So cute. And I thought this was the cutest little creamer. My friend Denise, yes, it got that for me at a um, estate sale. I love this too. I saw where you found yes, this. Yes, I found time. those. Um, at Hobby Lobby, they're on some clear jars and they fit over that. I actually have this. I didn't even realize it till I looked at it. I um. Is that what you have your honey in? No, that's what I have. My um, I made it up some baking soda and some fucking oh. oil scrub, uh, or it's not. You know, I put oils in it yeah. in my cleaner, and that's what I made it up in. Yep. So yeah, it was cheap. The jar was only like two dollars. Yeah, and if you, and that, I don't even know that might have been for regular price. If you get it when it's half off, it's even cheaper. I love your chalkboard. Thank you. I have that big frame. Before I um, deleted my page on um, Facebook, I had asked everybody what I could do because it was such a big frame. I got that from Angie Barnett. She's another junker, and her stuff is, I'll never achieve Angie Barnett level, but I'm trying. I'm trying real hard. <laughs> her stuff is beautiful. But I got that frame from her, but I ended up just getting a piece of plywood, the thinnest piece of plywood I could find and painting it with chalk paint. So that's the only piece I could find big enough to fit it. Um, my brother hung that for me. So, I like that because I can change it out for the holidays and another little garland. And then this bench was my Papa Jim's that he made my granny. Um, all my grandparents have gone to be with the Lord, so anything I have of theirs is really special. My Aunt Yvonne was awesome enough to give me lots of things of theirs, so I was real happy. I've um, got my old Golden Flake potato chip. That is really cute. I got that at um, Rustic Relics, too, and some different hydrangeas. And my Aunt Kim gave me this old... <laughs> cheese grater and, and a gonna, picnic basket another picnic basket i love that pillow too did you already say where you got that kirkland's last year mm-hmm and then over little here little corner shelf i my love this corner shelf. my brother made me that got another tin can from the land looks good and um most of this all that came from the thrift store all those pieces those did that did the chopper I like your plant in that. Thank you. I changed that out. That was in a, um, what's that thing called? Tobacco, not tobacco basket. A, uh, like, yeah. olive bucket. Oh, yeah, and yeah. And I found that number two, and it reminded me of the old crop. Yeah, it does. So I got that, and that's my Uncle James plant, and it's really taking off. I got it that looks when my so Uncle James good. passed away. So it's, I gave it some love and care, and it's taken off. So over here. Not a whole lot going on in the kitchen, but um, I had moved this and then I put it back just because I like it. I'll probably never get rid of it. No, I love that thing. And then I found this at the thrift store. I just love that That's little cute. plate. You know what? I have one of these and it's copper. And I didn't realize it needed the... I was wondering, always wondering how in the world... They use that to, um, like, mush, like, mush mm -hmm. tomatoes yeah. and stuff. And I, I, I normally candy. keep some fruit in there. But And then over here, still got my... Mrs. Myers, your little pig, my pig, and in the corner I've got my KitchenAid mixer and my little. I love pigs, and there's my I little. Love that. My little pig cross stitch, and an old cookbook, and the cookbook that Sis played actually was given to me. Um, that one on the um, easel. On the easel. Yeah, that was given to me at my. Um, oh, your bridal shower. And everybody wrote their favorite. Yep. And my everybody sent my aunt Kim their favorite recipes. Uh -huh. And this plate is my uncle Timbo's famous homemade vanilla ice cream, and my cousin Angie's butterfinger ice cream. Then uh -huh. just an old pie dish I found at the thrift store. I like it on this a lot with the little tea towel. And um, I love the 
I thought these would look like peaches. I, were, I wasn't sure if they were peaches or nectarines or what, but I love that cross stitch. I found that. And then my Ray Dunn and my little coffee bar. So cute. My favorite's the chicken. I love the chicken. That came from Raspberry too. And I found those old soda bottles from, oh, the, I didn't from those. the thrift store for a dollar. Nice. And this came from the Target dollar spot. My mom yes, got one of these. It's so cute. Look at her little pig. That's my little toothpick holder that came from my mom too when she got married. Bye. This is my little hallway. This came from Rustic Relics in Clayton too before they ever moved to their new shop. But and I just added um, a little candle and a little America sign that came from Kirkland's and just some faux greenery. I love that little sign. It's so sweet. And um, over here, I did have another picture, but I just added that it's from our wedding. Um, that was our guest book. So instead of a guest book, everybody signed the F which is for our last name Friday and now I have it displayed with all everybody's well wishes and thoughts. Yeah. Yeah. Let's show her the bathroom. Okay. So Buster's gonna show you the bathroom. You said My no, big old butt's no. hitting the <laughs> <laughs> So this is the same um as it was during our last tour but it says everybody wants to be Wants to change the world, but nobody wants to change the toilet paper. Be the change. <laughs> and that's for my husband. But he just still don't do it. He's, he doesn't read it. He left an uh, empty one in here this morning. And I had to change it before Holly got here. <laughs> she put me behind. And then I just, um, last time y'all came, came to do the tour, it was or winter. And I had a tree up here. Now I just have my little cotton wreath. And I've got my springy colors. I really love these hand towels. Those these came from so Target. Pretty. And I like this too. That's sweet. And this was from the Target Dollar Spot. That's your poo oh, spray. Wow. So if you if you drop a load, spray the spray. <laughs> Don't be rude. And then this is our little hand soap. And I love that. That is like a little beaker. Oh, that's cute. That was hidden over here. That's really cute. I love that. Beaker. Where'd you find that? Um, vintage picking. Cute. Okay. So this is the guest bedroom. Um, I love that. That came from Peach Park. That's really pretty. I love Peach Park stuff. I do too. I do too. And this is a little bit different. This is kind of, I call it my little memory room. Um, so it's got lots of pieces from our family and things like that. But um, still have my bedding. I did paint my furniture white and distress it. Look at Buster. He thinks he's hiding. <laughs> I got him hiding in the shower too. Did he you had the shower curtain over his head. He's hiding. He's <laughs> He's, he's, he's camera shy. He's camera shy, Harry. Okay, okay. There you go, there you go, okay. So, and over here, I've just got this old, um, it's not real, I don't know how old it is, but it's supposed to be like a um, oil lamp, but it's electric. I love my that. candle, and then my mother made this for my grandmother in 1980. And you can still see her little Inscription, she made that in ceramics glass. I love that. We've got to go find a class to take. I know. We would be good at it. And then my friend Jennifer that made me the dish rags, she also made me oh, this. I thought it was so, beautiful. That is. So pretty. And then my clamp in Alabama. Pillow. My pillow. Those came from Etsy. And there's my little desk. little desk where I pay my bills. Nobody wants to pay. Love the sewing machine. This came from my husband's grandmother, Granny. Shopping Granny's house is awesome. So she that is that. so awesome. I and love that. Oh, but I didn't take it off because that's what they used to put pins in. Oh, okay. Yep. When they were sewing. I love that sewing machine. That is so. I love it. That'll be fun to decorate. I know. And then um, my quilt rack. Those were my uncle James's mo mother's um, quilts. And then this is a really special piece. This came from my granny's house. Um, and on top, I got that from Mandy Lowry. If y'all don't know her, check her out. She, is a, she um, does vintage sales. But that is a sewing bucket. She has a Facebook page too. I yeah. Don't what it's called. Um, all kinds of kinds. Oh, yeah, that's it. All kinds of kinds, I think is what it's called. But that was really cute. And then I just got some more dried hydrangeas in my little, um, my little watering can. Buster's hiding again. 
that plant's pretty. And that is from when my uncle, not my uncle, goodness gracious, my grandfather passed away. This was a piece of the leaf that I got from his funeral, and it has been around for about 15 years. So pretty. It's lasted a long time. Mm -hmm. I can't even, this, I was young when he passed. My light's blown, but that's okay. I did hang, I finally hung up my beautiful picture my husband got me for Christmas. So pretty. It's so much prettier when you can see it. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so this is our bedroom. I'm screaming. I'm sorry. I talked really loud. Uh, this busher, for the love of God, you know not to get up here on the fancy one. Not when Holly's here doing our fancy home tour. Get down. <laughs> I left him on the bed, but I normally don't have my pretty comfort on here. I just put it out for home tours. <laughs> I love your bed. Um, so pretty. So, I added this picture of me and Corey. This is my favorite picture from our wedding. So pretty. And these came from the thrift store. I just chalk painted those and distressed them. Buster's hiding again under the bed. He thinks he's hid. Look at his legs. <laughs> <laughs> and then over here, I've got the Mr. and Miss, because Corey sleeps on this side and I sleep on the other. But turn on my lamp. I love your lamps. Thank you. Those came from Hobby Lobby. And these came from Walmart. And these are just old thrift store books that I painted. They look good. The old rugged cross. Thank you. Bedding's the same. And I did add this um, patriotic picture that came from Hobby Lobby. I got it for half off because it's the summer. And then it's pretty much the same over here. I did a little different Friday, 2017. And there's a picture of me and my husband. Sweet. There's my husband. Yeah, we've never seen him. There he is. Sweet. Oh, and on the, on the, the Yeah, wall. we forgot about him there. <laughs> that's, that's not my husband. That's somebody that stood in on the wind. He's, 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 he's nervous. He's not, he's, um, he's social anxiety. So that was a stand in. <laughs> so this is my little church pew and I just threw this this was at the Dollar Tree too just threw that, that one in. looks good yeah. it looks did you antique that one I'm guessing not mm -hmm. no or no wait this one went from Dollar Tree this one was from Amazon oh, okay excuse me the one that is on the back of the um and there in the living room is from Dollar Tree this one's from Amazon but it was only five dollars gotcha so but you could you could tea stain that too all you'd have to do is soak it in a bucket with some tea uh-huh you get your tea as dark as you want it, and you just soak it depending on how long you want to, and then you just dry it out now, like in the backyard to let it dry. And just some little blankets. And then my favorite piece in the whole, oh, one of the much whole house is my mirror. That came from Stray Cat's Home Decor. I love that so much. I'm with you. I think that's my favorite, just because I've never seen that before. I know it. I love it. It's unique. Cute. And look here. Look there. Just gonna shove it, stick it back in. Get in there. There you go. Now we're cooking. Okay. Looks good. And that's just a little tray from Target. And that's just where I have our soap and spray and lotion. And then um, I finally figured out a way because you now I told you this was the possessed mirror that no nothing would stay on. Yes, it. I remember uh -huh. that. So I have nailed. <laughs> Nailed the ribbon to it, and now it's, it's and it's good. staying up there. It is. I like the hardware. That's I, pretty. Thank you. I threw some holy water on there too, <laughs> just to be safe. And this has been here forever. Just my succulents and my little thing. This Love is, this. This is neat, and this came in my little Fab Fit Fun box, my little robe. But, That's cute. Um, got my bath bombs. And some more faux um, eucalyptus. This was my granny's too. I didn't even realize or notice this whenever I came in mm -hmm. earlier. That's really pretty. That was my granny's. My auntie Vaughn gave me that too. That is so pretty. And um, I love this down here. I know those came from Target. Yeah, the Magnolia Target. section. Yep, yep. Cute. And then all I've got over there are just a little basket of goodies for when people come to visit. Some body wash and then my succulent little arrangement. I love that. Where'd you find that? I know we have some of petals, but I don't think that one came from there. Hobby Lobby. And then That's I bought cute. the succulents and the moss and just put them in there. Thank y'all for coming to visit. I've got my hat on. <laughs> well, we appreciate y'all stopping by as always. Thank y'all for having yes, us. Buster enjoyed it. He always does. He's he's He loves his fans. 
Say y'all come back and see me. Say send money. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Thank y'all. Bye, Kayla. Thanks. Bye.